So Google is officially moving Tensor chip production to TSMC for its next generation processor, the Tensor G5. To make this transition, Google is reportedly replacing several Samsung-made components with off-the-shelf alternatives, with one of the most significant changes being the introduction of a fully custom ISP. Since its inception, Tensor has been a hybrid of Google-designed components and Samsung technology, relying on Samsung's Foundry and Exynos-based architecture. However, for the Pixel 10 series, Google is shifting to TSMC, moving away from Samsung's manufacturing process. According to a report from Android Authority, this switch requires Google to adjust its chip design, swapping out key components to fit the new fabrication process. Despite the shift, Tensor G5 will continue to incorporate several existing Google-designed elements from Tensor G4 and earlier iterations. This includes the TPU, DSP, memory compressor, and audio processor, which have remained consistent in Tensor's architecture. However, to accommodate the move to TSMC, Google is making notable modifications, the most significant being its development of a fully custom ISP. However, Google eventually dropped its custom ISP in 2021 when it introduced Tensor. With the Tensor G5, Google appears to be returning to an in-house ISP design. While these component swaps may not dramatically impact the user experience, they could result in performance shifts, whether improvements or drawbacks, once the new chip is implemented. The extent of these changes remains to be seen, but the move to a fully custom ISP suggests that Google is aiming to optimize image processing beyond what was possible with Samsung's ISP. Another major change, previously reported, is Google's decision to replace Samsung's modem with a MediaTek alternative. Samsung's modems have been a point of criticism in past tensor-powered devices, particularly in terms of power efficiency and connectivity reliability. A switch to MediaTek could address some of these concerns, while further distancing Google's custom silicon from Samsung's influence. With Tensor G5 marking Google's first TSMC-built chip, all eyes will be on the Pixel 10 series to see how these changes impact real-world performance, efficiency, and imaging capabilities. So, what do you guys think about the upcoming Pixel 10 series? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below, and as always, I will see you guys in my next video.